Hi, I'm Curtis Bennett, product developer here at HBX Controls, and today I'm very, very excited to introduce to you part of our new product line just launched in 2014, the CPU 550. As you can see, the CPU 550 is a completely redesigned CPU 500. As we like to say around here, out with the old and in with the new. The new CPU 550 has a full graphic display. It has a three button interface for very intuitive and easy programming. Some of the major features of the CPU 550 are the multiple applications. You can do boiler staging, mixing, differential set point, as well as pump sequencer in this small little package. You can do up to three boilers. And it has different pump selections like domestic hot water, system pumps, and boiler pumps. So these are just a few of the features included on the new CPU 550. Upon powering up the control, you can see the version number of this CPU. You can also see that we can choose a control type between staging, mixing, differential, and pump sequencer. For demonstration purposes, we'll use staging mode. One of the first things you'll notice about the CPU 550 is the vast amount of information on one screen. We can see all the temperatures, all of the targets, as well as all of the outputs connected to the control. We can see stage one, the boiler pump, the domestic hot water pump, and the system pump. You can also see programming buttons, the down arrow, the enter button, and the up arrow. You can also in this screen see that we have a red screen which indicates that stage one is on. So this is part of the full graphic backlit multicolor display. I'll go into the programming menu and you can see how simple it is. By holding the enter button we actually go into the setup menu. This allows us to go into the boiler setup, change our design temperatures if we have domestic hot water options, if we want a permanent heat demand, or if we want to change from Celsius to Fahrenheit. In these menus we can change multiple options. If we wanted to change the number of stages, we would just hit the button and move up the number of stages. You can see that your screen actually changes intuitively with the number of stages that you choose. It won't let you have any options that you can't choose with those number of stages. To get out of this menu, you just hold the button and it will back up one menu. You can also go up or down with these buttons, go into domestic hot water setup. We could put domestic hot water on, which will start to change some options on the output. And then we can see on the screen that now we have domestic hot water put on the screen, as well as we have the different demands that are on or off at the time. You can see here that we have stage number one is on, boiler pump is on, domestic hot water pump is on, and system pump is on. Each of these outputs corresponds to the position in the wiring. This is position one, this is position two, position three, position four. So you actually don't even have to look at a wiring diagram to know where to hook up your devices. This is just a quick introduction to the new CPU 550. Hope you enjoyed it all.